Grand Prix of figure skating. Today, it's the Grand Prix of China, presented by Viking Ocean Cruises. And this is the capital city of the People's Republic of China. Beijing, host city of the 2008 Summer Olympic Games and upcoming host city of the 2022 Olympic Winter Games. I'm Steve Schlanger with Tracy Wilson, and it should be an exciting ladies free program today, considering the fact that it is so tight at the top of the standings. Three skaters separated by less than a point in this third Grand Prix event of six on the season. The venue is the Capitol Gymnasium, which has been the host of the Grand Prix of China for the last decade. And here are the numbers in the standings after the ladies short. Dalman, Higuchi, and Radionova all separated by less than a point. Alina Zagitova just over one point out of a podium spot. And several competitors there with a shot of also getting into the top five. So it should be an exciting and pretty dramatic free program coming up. And this is the start list. 11 skaters set to take the ice in the ladies' free program today at the Grand Prix of China. American Amber Glenn leading things off. So, the city of Beijing, capital city of the People's Republic of China, hosting the Grand Prix of China here in its second day, third event of the Grand Prix season, and Group 2 featuring many of the favorites coming up next. One of the skaters we will see in this next group, Alina Zagitova of Russia, and not just in contention for one of Russia's three spots at the Olympic Games, but she could be a contender for a medal in Pyeongchang in February. No question. She's put up some big scores. She's about a point out of first. And if she puts up 147, as she did recently uh, in Italy, she will be tough to beat and easily catch the leaders. Wakabi Higuchi, a big jumper. No jumping errors, and the same true with Gabby Daleman. So Gabby's in first, Wakaba is in second for now. Gabby, too, talked about the fact this is a brand new day. <laughs> Turn the page, and uh, you know, basically, they're all starting with a clean slate. And Elena Rodionova, the third member of that group at the top of the standings that's separated by less than a point. And her jumping quality is a bit of a concern to me among this field. She uh, was able to keep it together in the short program, although you could see, Steve, she was tight in the jumping passes um, and just able to get the rotation in a longer program we'll see if she can hang in there no question she has the artistry to do so what's going to be the difference between those top three they're so close in the standings what is going to stand out that's going to make the difference in someone getting the win clean jumps uh and clean programs and also zagitova who is in fourth she will skate before the top three she has the highest technical content and the most difficult triple triple so she is a force to be reckoned with. As the warm-up continues, we will step aside. And then the favorites in the ladies free coming up shortly from the Capitol Gym in Beijing as we wind down the second day of competition at the Grand Prix of China.